hi everyone welcome back to the react js video tutorial and in this video we are going to learn what is a jsx and how we can use it with the react so these are some key points uh, that we are going to cover mainly in this uh, video so first is what is a jsx then how we can write the jsx styling conditions class and uh, comments all of these through all right so now first question is what is a jsx actually jsx is the templating style of the react and it will allow you to write your html inside the javascript directly and it will provide the higher performance optimized code uh, optimized output and it will allow you to uh, write a very easy code and you can uh, make faster development with this template so moreover we will learn with the code so now let's jump on the code so now uh, just make it right all right so uh, now let's start with the code so when you just start install your react then you will see there is something uh, you have javascript code and inside you directly return the html that how it actually possible so this is possible through the jsx all right that will compile your html inside the jsx so this is the basic fundamentals so now how we can do the another things so uh, now just going through with that so first of all how we can just write this uh, more code so let's say you have a variable like uh, data and it have some code like uh, 10 all right then how we can directly use it inside here all right so if you just put the data then it will like a string right so for that uh, just take one more html tag and here we will write some more code right so you have to simply use the single curly brackets and just write here data and let's see the output now here you can see the output here all right so if you just write here data plus 10 then it's still working right so even you can write here data equal to blah hello then uh, it will still work with the data dot blah right so that you can see that this is providing much more flexibility so let's see how we can use the conditions here so for that let's say your data have some value like 10 then if you want to check here if data equal equal to 10 then it will print match else not matched now you can see that it's match and if I just change something it will uh, go in inside the else condition all right so now uh, how we can add the comments for that you can just simply write here uh, curly brackets with the uh, slash and star and it will make you comment like this all right fine so now let's uh, take some more uh, things like how we can add the styling here all right so even you can add the classes and all but let's say you want to directly add your style with your small components you don't want to use global then you can just write here like uh, data now I'll just go here color red and here you can just use style data and now you can see that you got the red color here all right so <laughs> yeah i can just remove this if i if you want hello all right so it's uh, going to like work like this so now uh, if you are just going to add trying to add some classes so let's say you want to just add a class here class blah class 
so you will see that there is a warning that you cannot use this so for that because you have to use the class name because inside the JSX class name is already uh, exist as in some another properties and some an another classes so you cannot use this this is the result word all right so this is about the basics of JSX if you still have any question then you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe our channel thanks for watching this video